November 15th. 26. Agrippina, the mother of Nero, perished by order of her ungrateful son. She married the Emperor Claudius, whom she poisoned to raise Nero to the throne. 1213. The first regular English parliament assembled by writ at Oxford. 1280. Albertus Magnus, a Swabian philosopher of extraordinary genius, died. His writings have been collected in 21 volumes. Folio. 1577. Francis Drake sailed from England with five ships and 164 men, professedly on a voyage to Egypt, but really with the intention of sailing into the Pacific, where no English flag had ever been. 1591. Barnabas Brisnius strangled at Paris. He was an eminent French lawyer and ambassador to England. 1647. John Victor Rossi Janus Nicius Erythrus died. A Roman of noble birth, who devoted himself to literary pursuits. 1653. Aloysius Judlaris, an Italian Jesuit, died. He wrote 100 panegyrics on Jesus Christ, and 40 on Louis the Thirteenth. 1680. The bill excluding James, Duke of York, from the succession to his brother's throne, passed by the Commons, was defeated in the House of Lords, all the bishops, voting against it. 1695. In the neighborhood of Limerick and Tipperary, Ireland, a shower of matter fell resembling butter or grease, and was gathered into pots by some of the inhabitants. When laid on the hand it melted, but placed by the fire it dried and became hard, emitting an offensive odor. 1712. A duel was fought in Hyde Park, London, when the Duke of Hamilton and Lord Mohun were both killed. 1745. The town of Carlisle surrendered to the troops of the pretender to the English throne. 1747. John Peter de Mendagers, a French historian, died. He wrote a history of Gaul. 1751. Henry St. John, Viscount Bolingbroke, a celebrated English politician and philosopher, died, aged 80. A panegyrist has observed that in his writings he united the wisdom of Socrates, the dignity and ease of Pliny, and the wit of Horace. 1761. John Saw of Delanu, a French actor and dramatic writer, died. It was on his account that Voltaire wrote The Princess of Navarre, that he might act the chief character. 1763. The British Parliament by a vote 273 to 111, resolved that the North Britain, a paper conducted by the noted Wilkes, was a scandalous and seditious libel, and ordered it to be burned by the common hangman. Great riot in consequence. 1777. Fort Mifflin evacuated by the Americans, after a most noble and gallant defense. The British fired 1,030 cannon shot at the fort during the day. 1787. Christopher Gluck, an eminent German musical composer, died. He introduced a new style of music into Paris. 1793. John Nicholas Huchard guillotined at Paris. He raised himself to the highest rank in the army, and displayed his abilities in several important victories. 1793. Jean-Marie Baptiste Roland de la Platier stabbed himself to the heart on receiving news that his wife had been guillotined. His knowledge of commerce and political economy led to his appointment of minister under Louis and under the Republic. 1793. Fort Louis taken by the Austrians under Wurmser, and 4,000 French and 112 cannons captured. 1794. John Witherspoon, a signer of the Declaration, died. He was a Scotchman, 
who came over to take the presidency of Nassau Hall. His influence upon literature was greatly beneficial, and his talents as a preacher of the most popular kind. 1797. Joseph Milner, a learned Scottish divine and historian, died, aged 54. 1802. George Romney died. An eminent English painter. 1811. Frederick James Best, an eminent German scholar, died. He took advantage of a diplomacy at Paris to make some valuable researches among the treasures of the Vatican which had recently been transported there. 1812. The Cossacks under Platov fell in with twelve pieces of French cannon, and an immense train of carriages filled with plunder, abandoned by the French army. The horses lay dead in their harnesses, and mingled with them lay hundreds of human bodies, which had perished from the intense severity of the cold, from hunger and fatigue in their retreat from Moscow. 1816. The bells of Notre Dame, Paris, were formally baptized under the names of the Duke and Duchess of Angoulême. 1827. George Tomline, an eminent English bishop, died. His works display great erudition. 1828. Cayuga and Seneca Canal completed. 1848. General Messenhausen, the commander of the National Guard at Vienna, executed. 1849. The steamboat Louisiana exploded her boilers at New Orleans, when 60 persons were killed, and a great many wounded who afterwards died. 1852. The Lobos Islands difficulty between the United States and Peru was settled by the withdrawal of the American pretensions. 1852. John Hamilton Reynolds, an eminent English poet, contemporary with Byron, died in the Isle of Wight, aged 56.